today I actually hatched the dark omen just like 10 or 15 or maybe 20 minutes ago. So this is already at like level 7. I'm going to show you the stats right now for level 7. I just hatched the crab king. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, so stats. Bro, does this game give you guys some bring back some memories? Yes, it really does to me because we are. I'm in B, the original BGS, but I'm not here to like play or talk about to talk about the sequel of BGS that is coming and it has been leaked. So we, our first message, Isaac said, he says that a uh, no BGS sequel is coming. People have begged long enough about it. People keep releasing cheap knockoffs of my IP and making money off of it. So now I'm gonna make it. So I'm guessing Isaac was just getting tired of people ripping off, you know, those like bubblegum knockoff games. So the team and him are now going to make BGS 2. When I first found out, it was like really shocking to me. I was like, damn, bro. I mean, I have like thought we'll never get a BGS sequel ever. Like I thought like maybe after BGS, like he wouldn't make other one again. Seeing that he's saying that a BGS sequel is coming is really good. The name is not going to be called bgs2 but it is gonna have bgs in the name so it's probably gonna be like something like maybe like bubblegum simulator reborn bubblegum simulator x maybe bubblegum simulator comeback I, I don't know uh he does say bgs is going to like have like pretty much like everything from like the original bgs and then some other like new aspects coming to the game but he did say like he's trying to release the game in like two months or so and he also said silently is back and, and she'll be like doing all the maps and pets and also once comes out like all the like previous like games like bgs mining simulator one mining simulator two uh pet captures those events are going to be removed and all that once bgs2 comes out and if you're wondering if you're going to get a bonus for spending robux in pet catchers and bgs yes you will get a bonus in pet catchers in bgs2 if you spent money on pet captures and bgs i'm not sure like what type of bonuses you're going to get for spending like a lot of money on bgs i'm pretty sure i'm might be like exclusive pet maybe like exclusive like bubble i'm not really sure though and he's also trying to also make it not too grindy as well and he's also gonna come up with like you know how new worlds you just had to like jump up but he's gonna like make it so like where you lock a new mode a new world you can unlock all the islands for it so he said that th he's gonna have like everything planned out on release like a lot of content so like first update we're gonna have trading uh competitive boards all that stuff he also said that there's gonna be like they like grind with like other people and like friends like in like world events which is like really really cool because pgs2 is not gonna be just like a solo grinding game it's you can also grind with friends all that and then he also for the pets like you know how like in bgs let me show you so you know how we only have like shiny and like shiny mythical well there's gonna be a lot more to that in bgs2 there's a lot of pets are just gonna be more than shiny and mythical so there's gonna be probably maybe like dark matter maybe rainbow all of that original bgs but i'm here and then also he's gonna vest into like concept art so like if you guys are like artists like if you want to draw like some pet ideas that the team should add to the game then uh isaac's gonna be doing that and then also he's playing on like you know how usually like the three eggs uh in bgs costs like uh, Robux for to get three eggs. It's gonna be like unlocked for free with unlocks with the in-game currency, which I think is really good that they're trying to focus mostly on free to play. But yeah, he said apparently the quests are gonna be simple, which is pretty good. He like okay, so like how I was talking about the islands, cause like the islands, you know, in BGS, like you just have to jump on clouds just to get to the next islands, and that's kind of boring. So like Isaac said, like he wants to like make it like more engaging, not just with like cloud jumping, but he kind of wants to make it so like it might be like way like a little bit challenged to get to new islands going to make the make it like new worlds like have like more gravity and like require bigger bubbles to go higher up which is really good he said there's gonna be like a lot of old pets like 
returning, but like there's gonna be a lot of bunch of new pets, of course, because it's a new game. Why would you not make new pets? And you're always gonna have a high, like a grindy bubble teams for that. So you probably need to keep your bubble teams as well. And then once the game releases, BGS2, he is gonna bring back this Hatchers channel, which is basically like, you know, how the old secret Hatchers channel and stuff. It's gonna be back and all that. So, <laughs> can't wait for that redemption, the return. Uh, he also does have uh, inventory size game passes. So like, everyone will just now have the same size. He is gonna plan on re like updating this game a lot. Yeah, it's pretty good if you want some like more replayability to your game. There's gonna be also like a cap to serials in the new game. So like previously would, so like only like a like, small amount, like rarity pets will have a serial number, but like if it's not that rare, then we'll have a serial number. It could be, and he said the serial number could go up to 999. He he also wants like every world to start like a low currency multiplayer which makes sense so every world is also gonna have more gravity so you would need to blow more bubbles and he said that yes he is gonna try to put have a proper sequel which is pretty good and then he also wants the islands have different themes rather than just giant chests because like look i could show you guys an example right now okay so this island has like a huge chest so like you don't want like, so this is why he wants to change things up because like with like a lot with like lgg bgs it had like a lot of chests and then he also wants to have like a global silver boss battle everyone could like teleport to which oh man that's gonna be so cool to do silver boss hopefully they make the silver bosses battles are like really good also he's also not sure if pets are gonna have levels i mean it's just kind of important to like og bgs uh yeah yeah i know i'm flexing my secret pet uh, collection but look at this these pets have levels so level 25 level 25 level 25 yeah you probably get the point by now bringing like a premium currency which is going to be like extremely grinding to get but it at least gives like a lot like more purpose to like even play the game more and then he says there's going to be like mini games so like so okay so you know how we have like we have doggy jump right and you have to like jump like that yeah, i'm just gonna die so I can show you the next one. And then you know how this is guess the pet and you just guess. So he's kind of referring to mini games like that, but maybe they're going to be like actually like different mini games. Shiny, like a pet rarities that like shinies could be crafted into like various like mod modifiers, not figured out yet. So it's kind of like pet cylinder 99. Like you craft like shinies for like a uh, rainbow. And then he's also planning to also like, yeah, as I said, like many ways to grind with your friends as well, not just like solo. And yes, there will be AFK hatching. Don't worry, guys. Uh, that is not going away. There's going to be like mini games and there's going to be silver wide boss events on islands. Everyone has to like work together to defeat it which I think is a really cool concept and it was in pet catchers too. And yes, there's also gonna be a competitive leaderboard like bubbles, hatch, eggs, leaderboard, maybe damage. There's also the BGS spot is gonna come back for the hatchers channel, so yes, there is. So it's planned to have most of the features on release and then some features like over time. There's not gonna be no transfers, so you can't transfer your pet to a new, to the new BGS2 game. The new BGS, the new BGS is gonna have, it's gonna be a fresh new start you're gonna have to grind bubbles. You're gonna have to hatch pets all over again, which I know for some OG BGS fans are like, bro, why can't I trust my secrets? Bro, it's a new game, bro. When you give everyone a chance to start over, even like new players that haven't played BGS before. Regions, like countries, all that should be able to play the sequel. There will also be OG bubbler again uh, tag. As you can see on BGS, if I type the hi, so you see I have OG bubbler, the premium, currency bonuses won't be anything crazy but it'll we'll do likely an exclusive pet plus so okay the hats are gonna be because someone asked if there's gonna be hats on like release but he said it's not gonna be on release that's cool because the original bgs so if i clip a hat here because look at the hats make the pets look really unique too but there's gonna be a lot of like good content to um on release so that's really good there will actually be secrets but they're gonna be actually hard to get for the bgs spy he's thinking of hooking alt account so when your alt account touch of pets you'll still get message i guess on your he's gonna it's gonna allow six eggs because like to be honest three eggs is kind of outdated like most games allow six or eight eggs these similarities we see nowadays they want to allow infinite inventory size but like they have not confirmed this yet they're planning on the the modifiers being shiny 
mythic xl so legendary slash secrets can also be hatched it can be hatched into mythics any pet can be hatched into xl so like secrets legendary any pet could be crafted or created into shiny and the xl will be very rare so you got if you get an xl secret that'll be like super 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 rare he's gonna try to make the part two egg teleport you to the new game when you use it eventually the hard leveling comes easy over time due to the grinding slash power okay so he's talking he's talking about the og music so yes the og music's gonna be like still there but it's gonna be like a new version like revamped it's probably like a remix or something or remastered some pets will have a certain amount that could ever be hatched once that number is reached no one will be able to hatch from it. the egg okay that's good uh i think he said the max pet limit i think was five he said that there's just met on release there's like no limited egg so there's not gonna be a limited egg on release oh he says that he's planning on doing rebirth but like it probably won't be infinite i may just rename it to pristine so it's kind of like pet similar to 99 uh the secret text is coming back to bgo so as you can see soon so i think that's like the giant robot or something but that's says the secret text and then he also said there's gonna be no agents actual secret okay so here's the the leak of how the flavors shop's gonna look like so we got the bubble gum bubble berry pizza cherry donut chocolate watermelon contrast gold uh he's also gonna show like the existing count of every pet in the game which pet swimmer 99 does so bubbles will be useful to grind he's also gonna add it so like give like people later upgrades that everyone care for free but they just get a really like plus one egg hatch if that makes sense yeah. he's also on planning to have clans so i guess this is where like oh you could grind like to be competitive with like your friends and all that so pers progression will be more balanced so you won't be able to get to the end of the new world instantly uh his goal is not need to have a delete feature at all i don't know about that i mean for secrets and all that i would probably like have the delete feature off for those but like if you get like the same legendary like so many times or any pet like that's like epic and all that uh we could say that i would probably do a delete button for those but secrets and all that no don't have the delete button on. and he also is not planning on to uh, like add pay the win benefits that means so lets you skip to the end he's also making it so like if you if you disconnect it'll just put you you could just like it could it just put you back at the same egg so the events he's talking about is going to be events worlds limited items and super wide events that happen probably to keep people social working together okay so this is a leak which that's like the shiny i think my thoughts on bgs2 i'm hoping maybe like if they just do this like correctly they could probably like pass pet rng pet simulator 99 and maybe rubble studios will finally have their number one combat and hopefully overthrown Preston from big games is crown and yeah i'm so excited for bgs2 let me guys know what you guys think down below about bgs2 i'm pretty hyped for it uh, if you guys like this video make sure you leave a like subscribe check out my other videos here and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out